what's your name? My name's Lizzie. Uh-huh, Lizzie, and uh, what, what grade are you in, Lizzie? I'm in third grade. So you're 10? No, I'm Nine? eight. Yeah, that was gonna get us eight next. I was gonna <laughs> keep going. All right, and uh, you've got something on your shoes there. What kind of, this is your invention. Yes. And, and what made you think of whatever this is? Well, in Connecticut, we get a lot of snow, and on the weekends, um, during a snowstorm, my dad goes out and shovels the driveway while my mom likes to sleep in. Oh, well, that's a sweet dad that you have there that goes out and shovels the driveway. So, and uh, you came up with something to help, it yeah. seems, okay. And it makes shoveling the driveway more fun. Fun, too, which would be great to have fun and, uh, and, and accomplish something at the same time, right? Isn't that yep. always the best way? Great. Okay, so let's um, see, this side, take this off. Okay, there's snow in here. Do you need help? No, I'm fine. Okay. It's kind of hard doing this with both feet. Wow. That's great. wonderful idea. That's a really good idea. Somebody should do that. Okay, you're going to stay in there or you're coming out? What do you want to do? I'm staying in here. Yeah, it's fun. You stay in there. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Hi. What's your name? Kendra. Hi, Kendra. And uh, where, what grade are you in? Fourth. Fourth. And so you're uh, eight? Nine. Yep. <laughs> All right. So uh, you're nine. And what did you come up with? Um, it's the bather. The bather? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's an entire device that bathes you? No, you put it on your head. Okay. And it scrubs your back. Oh. Yeah. That's great. <laughs> Are you getting a good scrub like that? Uh -huh. Yeah, you'll get real clean. That's great. <laughs> Kendra, that's a wonderful idea. What made you think of that? You couldn't reach or something one day? No, my, I was watching my cat and he was cleaning himself uh -huh. and he couldn't reach his back. Uh -huh. And it got me thinking how people with broken arms could reach back there and scrub their back. What a wonderful idea for someone that can't... Kendra, that's very smart. Get one for your cat, too. All right. Now, you're not wearing a mic because are you going to get in that tub or something? What's your name? Griffin. Griffin, and what grade are you in? Fourth grade. So you're 10. Mm-hmm. Ah. <laughs> Eight, nine, 10. I knew I'd get it sometime. Griffin, what did you invent here? A uh, bathtub. I've seen them before, by the way. <laughs> I, I, someone's already invented that. Um, it's an arm that holds your book over the bathtub. All right, let's take a look. It's on his way. Can, and well, I came up with the idea when I saw my mom in her book with the bathtub. Uh -huh. I just walked by. I didn't mean to. <laughs> <laughs> so, and um, you can adjust it like this uh -huh. to see your reading point of view, uh -huh. and you can easily turn the page. By just doing this and I'm right. clicking it. Right. That's a wonderful idea. Griffin, yes. that's great. All right. We have one more kid inventor right here, and your name is? Chris. Chris? And Chris, so what grade are you in? I'm in fourth grade. You are 10. Nine. <laughs> All right. And uh, you have a helmet, so there's yes. some kind of danger involved, I would imagine. Yes. What, what is it, and what made you want to do it? Well, it is a fan-powered skateboard. A, a fan-powered skateboard? Yes. Oh, that's, so, so there's no effort involved? Well, yes. Okay. And all you have to do is push off when you turn it on. Mm-hmm. And my idea coming up with it is people get tired of riding their skateboard by pushing it just with their feet. They sure do. I know I do. All right. Let's take a look at it. OK, 
Okay, let's take a look at it. And you just turn it off when you're done, yeah. right? That's a wonderful invention. That's really fantastic. Thank you so much, all of you, uh, for sharing your ideas and your inventions. You're all getting an Apple MacBook computer with a built-in seven-hour battery. And